Now this one tool is a game changer in your entire CAD preparation. And what is it? That's the MockCAD's Quant Concept Checklist. Now if your Quant preparation is not translating to marks, this video is for you. Now after mentoring thousands of students over the past decade, I noticed a simple pattern. It's not about you not putting in the right kind of effort or the hard work, right? It's just one missing thing, one gap that's holding you back from attempting those extra questions and getting those extra marks when crossing that 99 percentile barrier. Now this is exactly what the MockCAD Squan concept checklist solves. Let me explain to you logically as to how this is going to make a world of difference in your preparation. Now before I get on with it, let me tell you that we are offering the complete self-study pack for 2025 at just rupees 699. And you know what? We're going to drop it further by another 40 percent, bring it down to rupees 499. If you use the coupon code GRAB499. So what does the self-study course contain? It contains all the video lessons from the basics going up all the way to the advanced concepts. It also contains all the concept revision videos which I'm going to speak about in this video with the concept checklist. It also has your L1, L2, L3 practice. It has speed concept questions to ensure that you've learned things the right way. It also contains 700 daily quizzes, 750 booster quizzes, and of course the jumbo test series pack. Now this jumbo test series pack, you get 55 cat mocks, 68 mock omits, and you're gonna be getting about 126 sectionals. This is one of the largest test series that's available for you. All of this, I just rupees 499 for a very limited time. Use the coupon code GRAB4999, hope it works. We also directly mentor and work with students on the MockCats Unlimited Pack. If any of you are interested in that, just give us a call on 9600-121800. We'll be happy to connect with you. Now coming back to this video, now let me logically explain to you as to how this quant concept checklist along with the concept revision videos are going to make a difference in your quant preparation. Now in the CAT exam, you're going to have 22 questions. But the number of lessons are also around 20 to 28, right? We have 28 lessons. Now, are you going to get a question from each lesson? No, right? Some of those lessons you wouldn't get. Would you be getting about four to five questions from each lesson? Definitely not. You'll get one or max two, right? So what is going to be the pattern for your exam? You're not going to be getting all the arithmetic questions first, followed by algebra and so on. You're going to have a profit loss question, then suddenly it moves to P and C permutations combinations then you get a question on quadratic equations then it goes to probably time and work and then it goes on to coordinate geometry and then it's back to number systems right so now you should be knowing the concept you need to apply at the back of your mind and when you're reading that question it should flash for you and you should immediately apply right that requires a lot of preparation you just can't be winging it with just one or two simple formulae and go about this process now let me explain to you with a simple example over here. Now people keep saying shortcuts, shortcuts and shortcuts and formulae, please know that. So the formulae all of us know as to what it is. Now what are these shortcuts? That's your conceptual understanding, right? That's what is contained in the quant concept checklist. So in the description below, you have two items. First is a Google sheet that contains the quant concept checklist. You have six sheets over there. Numbers, arithmetic one, arithmetic two, algebra, modern maths and geometry. The second is a link to the interest and growth concept revision video. Now, what is that? The entire concept checklist, right? The items which you're going to have over there, that's explained in terms of a 16 minute video, just for interest and growth. Now, of course, is this 16 minute video going to be fine on a standalone basis? Probably not. I want you to go through the two, two and a half hour lesson first, right? Take notes and understand it. Then work on the 16 minute video uh, that will serve as a revision for you. You can't be watching the two and a half hour lesson over and over again. But a 16 minute video, you definitely can. And that is what is practical for you and will work out. So what does a 16 minute video contain in a lesson like interest and growth? Interest and growth, a lot of you would be saying that, you know, I, I know only two formulae. That's what I was taught in school. Uh, simple interest is P and R by 100. Compound interest is P into 1 plus R by 100 whole power N. That is in fact wrong. It's not the compound interest, it's the amount. Amount equals P into 1 plus R by 100 whole power N in the case of compounding. So what is this quant concept video of 16 minutes going to serve over here? It's going to comprise of all the other concepts which could be applied, right, in terms of a shortcut while answering these questions. I'll give you a few examples. In the case of simple interest, we know P and R by 100, that's the formula, great. How does it work? Every year the interest is PR by 100, n times you add it up, it becomes P and R by 100. It doesn't stop over there. I could bring in a ratios concept and frame a question, right? So how could that be? If the ratio of principal is given to you as 3 is to 5, 
the ratio of time period is given to you as 2 is to 3 and the ratio of let's say the rate of interest given to you as 5 is to 4. Then what is the ratio of simple interest? You can simply directly multiply the ratios the left and right. So it's going to be 3 into 2 into 5 is to 5 is to 3 is to 4. That gives you 30 is to 60 which comes to 1 is to 2. And that's a way in which you can quickly answer this kind of a question. What about the other concepts? It can be something like compound interest, understanding how compound interest works. The first year's compound interest is the same as the first year's simple interest. The second year's compound interest is going to be a little different because you're going to have the uh, simple interest as well as the interest on interest. For example, if it's 5% simple interest for two years, it's 5 plus 5, 10% of the principal. If it's compound interest, it's 5% for the first year. The second year is going to be 5% again plus interest on interest, 5% of 5 which comes to 0.25%, it totals up to 10.25%. Next up, what grows at the rate of interest? Under compound interest, two of them. It's not just the amount, but also the annual compound interest. The accumulated interest doesn't. If you're given the accumulated interest for three consecutive years, and you find the differences, right, between two consecutive years, and you get the yearly interest, observe the growth rate over there, and you'll find out the rate of interest. Then you have non-annual compounding, discounting to find the present value, EMI, CAGR, SI is a multiple of principal, compound interest is a multiple of principal, etc. Right, so there's quite a bit over there. So some of you might not be understanding what I'm saying right now as well, right? Just look at the concept revision video in detail, right? Just click on the link, log in over there. It's a free registration at mockcat.com and you should be able to view it. So will the concept revision videos directly work for you? Uh, yes, for some and for some, no, right? Who, do, who would it work for? It will work for those who are already at a 95 percentile plus, right? You'll be able to uh, relate to it. The basics are done. You should be able to understand directly from this. Now, those of you who are not yet there, just complete the lessons properly, right? Make sure you understand the concepts. Take notes once. After that, it's only this concept revision video you have to rely on. So once the lessons are done, watch the concept revision video, take a concept quiz. Once again, watch another concept revision video from the next lesson and take another concept quiz. Continue with this process. Do not keep doing the same concept revision video over and over again. Because if you keep doing that, and if you don't space it out and do it at different points in time, you're going to forget what you learned first when you come to the end. Right? So space it out. Watch the concept revision video at multiple points. A 16-minute video, after a certain point in time, you'll end up watching it in about five to six minutes right click works you can watch it at 2x speed as well once you're able to restate the concepts with your own examples the way i've provided over there you will be able to get a percentile which is very close to mine once again if you master the checklist and you know the concepts in and out you're going to be cracking the section with the right kind of practice no more aimless revision no more endless note taking just a clear focus path on what you need to do next. That's what you get at MockCat in case you're interested in the self-study course or the unlimited two visit our website. Uh, use the coupon code provided once again, grab 4 triple nine. that works for the self-study. In case the unlimited, you can just con give us a call. We'll be happy to connect with you. Make use of this concept checklist along with all the endless practice and the mock tests and the sectionals and you should be in a position to crack this CAT exam. All the best.